Hey folks, uh, we're here with Soldiers Angels at the VA Hospital in Madison, and we're going to present Mary, the Volunteer Services Coordinator, with a check from Soldiers Angels. Chris, why don't you go ahead? Uh, <laughs> on behalf of Soldiers Angels, thank you for all you do for our soldiers. Love that. Thanks a lot. Well, thank you. I, this is very, uh, very generous, and we certainly do appreciate it. And I can't believe all the stuff you brought here today. It's gonna. Well, hi. This is Chris from Soldiers Angels, right? Hi, Chris. This is Chris from Soldiers Angels. We're I'm at the a community team leader for Wisconsin. All right. We're at the uh, VA hospital here in Madison, bringing some stuff to the fellas and the uh, ladies who are here. Yeah. Now, this is a uh, what? Soldiers Angels backpack? What do yeah. they call this? It's a vet pack. It's a vet pack. Wow. Vet pack. Got good stuff in it. Yeah. Yes. Yep. You got so all of your toiletries. Yep. And some socks and some underwear and some shirts and some sweatshirts. Looks like sweatpants. Yeah. Very nice. So we brought what about fifty of those? Mandy. Keep them. Okay. Gotcha. So those go to the soldiers in Germany. Yep. They actually go to the soldiers in Germany um, when they come in after they've been wounded, and a lot of times when they come from the battlefield, they come with nothing. Okay. So the Soldiers Angels provide them with at least some basic needs and toiletries so that they have something when they get to the hospital. Fantastic. But you didn't introduce yourself. I'm Janet. Hi, Janet. <laughs> <laughs> and over here we have... Hi, I'm Rhonda. And oh. I'm just a volunteer. I just wanted to show you guys this beautiful art that well. That wow. This is handmade. This was like way cool. Wow. I love it. It'll be keep coming nice and warm. And we have some hats and matching slippers in there. <laughs> Show one of the blankets. Everybody loves the Soldier's oh, Angels oh. blue blankets. Oh, yeah. I want one. <laughs> yep, that's it. Yeah, and they're the police blankets with the embroidery of Soldier's Angels. Very cool. And we got about, I think we got about 20, 25 of these. I thought there were two boxes, so I yep, think there may be 50. there's two boxes. There's quite a few there's of them 50. in here. Yep. A calendar. All right. And we got several bags of books. Or if metrosexuals might want that. Or that's yeah. true. That's true. <laughs> and where's my camera lobby? And that is the Soldier's Angels Challenge Coin. That's also very cool. And that's the back. <laughs> very neat. And that is a close-up of the Soldier's Angels pin with the soldier superimposed on the angel wings. Very cool. Oh boy. Look at all those gorgeous blankets. That is oh, some yeah, nice that, stuff. That's to put on the back of a wheelchair. A wheelchair. Oh, that's beautiful. 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 Hey, folks. Uh, what's your name, sir? My name is Merle Phillips. Merle, when did you serve, and who did you serve with? I served in uh, 67 and 69 with the Army. With the Army? I'm guessing Vietnam? Yes, it was. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty sure my father was there a couple of those years. He was with uh, he Big Red One and 11th ACR. Old, but I... <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm younger than I look. Yeah, must be, that must be what it is. <laughs> what units were you with? Uh, I was with the 101st Airborne uh, Headquarters Company, uh, 326 um, Engineer Group, Combat Engineer. Right on. So. Blowing stuff up and then building stuff in the on the rubble, right? Yeah, basically, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. He will treasure this. He's a good young man. Well, we're here with Mr. Rice. Uh, now, you were telling us a couple things. First of all, you hurt your legs in training, yeah. but that you also, you got a grandson who's in Marine Corps boot camp? My grandson just started Marine Corps boot camp in December. He'll be uh, graduating on the 14th of March. And if, if I can, I will be there for you. It should be a proud day. Yes, it will. There is almost nothing looks more impressive than a Marine in his dress blues. Except an Army person in their beret. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you said the right thing. Yes. I'm former 18 Bravo Special Forces oh, is weapon, so. Is that right? Yes, I'll it is. Yep. yep, so uh, I am, uh, I would say still, I would go second to the Marine Corps yeah. dress blues Amen. still, even with the Girl Scout hat on. Yeah. <laughs> Well, now, you mentioned that you uh, had previously been in the business of uh, making coins, but that you right. now have retired to Wisconsin and you started a new business. When we, uh, uh, after I got out of the service, my legs took me out of the service, and uh, I worked in the casino business for a while in Las Vegas. 
And then we had some things happen that caused the family to kind of re, reprioritize. And we led to uh, our own business. Uh, we developed a laser engraving and cutting business. And we were about 95% Air Force. And uh, we did work for General Sanchez in Baghdad, General uh, Casey in Baghdad, uh, General Rand in Baghdad, all the way down to Snuffy Jones, uh, serving all around the world. And uh, uh, we had a great business going on. Uh, and we finally decided, after 10 years, we decided that we had, had the need to slow down. So we retired back here to where my wife has a brother who has a laser business. And uh, we couldn't stand the, the peace and quiet of retirement because there's no vacations or anything. So we uh, have developed a new product and a new business. And the new business is called Warrior Awards. And uh, it is our first developed product is a coin box for coins of all shapes and sizes. And it's a revolving uh, a octagonal uh, display that can be added to the first the base unit has two levels and it will hold 28 coins and each coin level after that will hold 12 and it can be added to by the individual uh, and we just started our new website where uh, this incident whoops this incident uh, uh, stopped us from putting it out on our website this week What's so, the, what is the website? The website is Warrior Awards, W A R R I O R A R D S dot com. Very good. And uh, it will have that on there. That'll be our first product and should be on by next week. Fantastic. And, uh, I, tell you, I tell you what we'll do. We'll go ahead and uh, I write it a couple pretty big military websites. We'll, we'll go ahead and put this up there. We'll put it. Fantastic. And, uh, I, tell you, I tell you what we'll do. We'll go ahead and uh, I write it a couple pretty big military websites. We'll, we'll go ahead so. and put this up there. We'll put a link to it and hopefully send some folks to your well, website to buy that cool coin box. Well, I tell you what, we'd sure appreciate it. We, uh, <laughs> Sounds like a great product. The, the guys have, uh, when I was in, just when Moses crossed the Red Sea, I think you the remember Christ that. Yeah, that's it. Uh, <laughs> they didn't have coins. Uh, Special Forces developed the first coins from what I'm of course, Special Forces developed the first everything. Pretty much, pretty much. So, uh, but now that we've got, now we've seen how, how really precious these things are to the, to the guys and the girls. And uh, when we handed out our gifts to the, to the, to the troops, they were made up of the, of the challenge coins. And we had people that were actually crying to, them, you know, to receive such a gift. So, so we treasure them too. Thank you very much. I will trade you this room. No, you can't have it. That's the only one I have. Oh, okay. <laughs> you can keep the soldier table. Okay. I was just showing you mine. No, so. it'll, it'll be fine. <laughs> uh, oh, you did a good yeah. job. Tory, the Tory Gate. The Tory Gates, Okinawa. That's well, right. Mr. Rice, appreciate your service. Appreciate what you've been doing as far as uh, Wounded Warriors and, and Warrior Awards. We'll make sure we get a link to that up and uh, hope Thank you're feeling you. better. Thank you very, very much. <laughs> All right. Hey folks, Uncle Jay, and we spent today at the William S. Middleton Memorial Veterans Hospital with uh, some of the soldiers' angels passing out blankets and all kinds of fun stuff to the folks here. Uh, here we have Janet, Chris, from the local soldiers' angels chapter. Uh, how did you think it went? It went absolutely wonderful. We met a lot of nice veterans, we talked to a lot of nice people, and some of their families. And we got some really good stories, too. Yes. Absolutely, and we found a new business we're going to support. Yes, yes, <laughs> yes. Warriorawards.com. Yes. Great.